effect reflections okay so okay good and then let's render this camera view as you can see in this rendered scene um, the room is properly brightened up with those uh, down light and uh, V-ray ceiling light okay but for the detail view uh, more like detailed view I'm gonna add some more lights light source for this uh, the floor stand and then desk lamp okay first I'm gonna add the light source for this desk lamp okay let's maximize left viewport and then let's go to front view and from here I'm gonna add V-ray light so light and then the V-ray and then let's click the V-ray light and then in this case I'm gonna use the sphere instead of plane okay so let's click and drag a little bit alright and this is V-ray light for this desk lamp let's go to top view and then let's move this light source to the proper position this should be the, the under the head of desk lamp okay around here okay so then I'm gonna adjust its property a little bit so this will be sphere and then luminance this will be uh, luminous power okay and then the multiplier is gonna be 2000 and then radius will be we can re increase its radius a little bit in this case I think 2.5 inch is enough okay and then the cast shadow inv invisible everything is same as before all right and then let's go to top view and then let's select this uh, spear v-ray light and then let's copy for the floor stand okay let's copy as an instance all right and then let's go to front view again and then this floor uh, stand has three different uh, birth so we need to copy again for the the bottom light I'm sorry I'm gonna copy and an instance and then we need one more that's it all right so I think we added all the light sources for different lighting device let's render this okay but I think I missed one step for this floor lamp and desk lamp um, because um, this desk lamp and the floor lamp is not fluorescent lamp it's a halogen lamp for those halogen lamp I think we need to change the the color of this light source okay now we um, applied the white color as a fluorescent lamp but uh, we need to change its color as uh, this kind of yellow okay so click OK that's it we don't need to change uh, this light source for the flow lamp because we copied this light source for this for this uh, flow lamp as an instance object so this instance uh, will inherit the mother's change so we don't need to change and then uh, let's render this all right now we have nicely rendered interior scene in the night view okay so this is just test render okay 
you can increase the rendering quality through the render setup okay so you can check the the information that I uploaded in our blog okay so you can increase the size of image and then you can also increase um, the light cache okay now it's subdivision is 100, uh, 100 so you can increase up to like a, a thousand to two thousand or and then you can change the irradiance map and built-in presets current preset is very low and you can change like medium or high for the better quality of the rendering so it takes time more don't forget that all right that's it